Hello, Mark Cookrow. Andrew Knight. Thank you for requesting the technique. So we're going to put a few videos out. This particular one we're going to do is on arm bars from the guard. So there's a couple things we're going to cover. Number one, how to get it correctly, where to, how to position your feet, your body, your hips, your legs, your arms. Also, how to prevent getting stacked and what to do when the stack starts and you're a little bit late. And also, how to clear the arms when you try to spin under them. Uh, and they get they block it with their arm on the mat. So let's go over a couple things. Okay, so First off, I'm in the guard. I need his hands to be here. You can pull the sleeves You can do a lot of things to get the arm across I want you to also consider pulling in with your heels and you can pull in with two hands You can grab here. You can grab the sleeve. It's totally up to you You can break their posture with your arm is it more leveraged than with your hand and start to walk this up. Okay, now turn this way a little bit. So what happens with this, and we'll just start here for now, is I pull this across, and you can hold, there's a lot of a lot of ways, but let's just start here. What you should do, instead of hopping your legs up, is walk one up at a time so you never lose contact. This foot goes in the hip and it pinches. And this is important because if you don't pinch, pull your arm out. It's very easy. Even if I have this pull, it's very easy. So I want to block this. Now the other thing is you can see my toes are pointed this way. They should be up and I'll get to that in just a second. Now when you have this arm pinch, can you sit up please? It's very difficult. He can push into me though. So I want to make sure that doesn't happen. So I lift my hips just a little bit and now he's pushing me into the mat instead of folding me. So I push, try not to do this. I want you to try the difference. Push, push back in. Go back, push back in because this is a frame. So this foot goes here, heel in, toes up. Shave the face here. Now watch my heel, it turns. Now if my toes are like this, come into me, stack. This is how you get stacked, okay? If your feet are like this, you're kind of doing it to yourself. So what you do when you're here is these go up. And when your toes go up, your core gets engaged. And then if you turn a little bit, now the weight's that way. Stack me, please. You just lift your hips a little bit. It's very difficult here, okay? If the stack starts a little bit, here, move away, toes up, and now you have the arm bar right there, okay? So the thing about this is when you have this here and you go, you have to make sure that you lift, block, over, turn. Okay, now we're gonna turn this way. So what will happen sometimes is you go here, you get the arm bar, and you try to spin underneath, and the person blocks. All you have to do, number one, get your feet like this again, take this hand, clear the arm, go right back, tip them over, and you have the arm bar. So it's really important that you don't let the person fold you in half. If you start to get folded, shoulder walk away a little bit, get your hips up, and then get your toes up, and then pull, put pressure on, pinch everything tight, and that should make a big difference. Thanks for watching.